very, very likely. But I'm curious what Kale has to say. There's gonna come a point pretty soon where we've gotta like abandon the main story and just go hard in side quests. We have a whole bunch of side quest stuff to do. Quiz mastering. Getting the uh, the wheels tables done. Little side quests here and there, like catching up with the uh, the painting guy with the model and other things. Hopefully this just leads us straight into the room. Hey, do these do anything? No. Hello. Okay, it does. Good. Good, good, good. Okay, this guy's a merchant, I think. Yep. I'm broke. I'm so broke, dude. I spent so much money last time around on recipes. I spent all my money on new recipes. Hey, how have you been? My condolences, by the way. If leaving the castle wasn't a death sentence for us, we would have attended the ceremony. Oh, shit. Garl. He's talking about Garl. It's okay. Don't worry about it. We need your help, Kale. Sure. What's the situation? It's a long story. Something about a machine. I love stories. Machines too, in fact. Let's hear it. Back in Sarai's world. Dot, dot, dot. This is the D&D part where you go like, and I tell them everything that I just learned. And reconnecting the sun and moon is our only chance of taking down the Dweller of Dread. Which, by the way, is like a Cthulhu-style Kraken monster at the bottom of the ocean. So we'll see how that whole fight goes down. It's going to be interesting. I see. So that's why we had to make so many condensers. And the Catalyst's kernel. I never thought I'd get to see it for myself. The Catalyst. Okay, that was the name of the machine. I beg your pardon, but that's AI core. I have no voluntary ties to the Catalyst. We understand you can't leave the castle, but we were hoping you could find some way to help always a way, but we need some time. Oh, and I'll need the Lorg Web War, too. Mm, just rip out the pages you need. I can't risk being unable to record something while you work. We'll get started right away. Can you give us a few days? Whatever you need. We can take this opportunity to visit some old friends. Run along, then. We'll be ready when you return. Okay. I guess we're kind of thrown into uh, doing side quest stuff now, I guess. Gather around, everyone. We have a lot on our plate. Access granted. It worked. Good job, Kale. Ha! And now we have access to the top secret catalyst blueprints, too. Extract everything. On it. Please be gentle. All right. Uh, oh, why? Why do we have to go back here? So this is the warrior cook's resting place? Yes, he always loved this tree. He once made some very tasty jam using its sap. Carl always made sure to prepare something for us. Hey. He sounds like a good friend. The best. Carl is the best. So you're saying your only function was attaching souls to machines. 
Everything was automated. I never understood why I had to be made sentient. The whole thing was quite unsettling. Just another cruel joke. Well, you're free now. Might be time for a fresh start. Oh? This idea is truly pleasing. You're right. Everything combined into the missing pieces we were looking for. Great. Let's start building. Double time. Hello. Hello. Badass Lady Gamer, good morning. And that is good to see that the channel point reward worked for that one at least. Yeah. I can't believe my eyes. I can't remember what your voice was. I wish I had conversed with Rashan a bit more. His understanding of alchemy is unprecedented. Does it hurt when you get hit? Like this? <laughs> Not in a physical way. It tugs in my mind, but my resolve is absolute. Most interesting. <laughs> a word? After this journey is over, you may find yourself in search of meaning. That should, should that time come, seek the Elder Mist. The Elder Mist? You like the Junior Mist stuffed in a bottle. Golly. Whoa, all right, so we recreated the whole cyborg machine. Thanks, Kale. It should only take a few seconds anyway, right? Uh, I am not too sure that this is a good idea. Come on, it's for a good cause for once. Science. You've seen the instructions too. There's no way they'll be able to reprogram Skybase on their own. I can't do it. You know this is the only way. You do this one thing for us and I promise we will give you a new form. Damn, Kale fucking taking the AI core hostage and making him do shit he doesn't want to do. Is Kale a baddie? We'll find out. I, I suppose so. All right, plus our design is pretty slick. You'll see. Load it up. On it. I like these guys. They're fun. Back at Mirth. Good morning. Sleep is so much better here in Mirth. It's been a couple of days. Kale should be done by now. Right. Let's go check on him. Getting close to the end of... Yeah, it seems like it. Seems like things are going. I don't know what to think about Garl's death. <laughs> Just... Dude. We're getting slapped on the face with a stick with Garl's name written on it over and over again. I miss Garl and all of his crops that he planted everywhere that I am gonna harvest up as soon as I can every time I visit the fucking town and then we're done okay good huh. god damn all right yeah we've got a lot of homies to visit we've got we've got we got a lot we got a lot of homies to visit we got to cruise around and do some things but we still can't fly home world that's what we're calling this home world where homies live because home you get it, right? I get it. We got Kale's message. I'll take you there directly whenever you need. Let's fucking go. Perfect. Well, this is it. I'm ready. Oh, you're ready. We're not missing out on that. But we only have one unit. And so we combine. Easy. Combine? We've always been together. 
No way are we letting you leave on your own. But in there, we'll... There's plenty of room for all of us. Oh, <laughs> what the fuck? They're gonna... <laughs> okay. Okay. So these are a bunch of really old 10-year-old kids. And what they're planning to do is they're planning to put on a giant trench coat and then stack one on top of each other to be one person. Except instead of just doing a trench coat, they're gonna do human centipede. It's gonna be very hot. Oh baby, oh baby. A shared conscience. <laughs> That'll do you some good, Kale. You've always been too serious. <laughs> Are you sure? We can't walk it back. Yeah, because you only have one pair of legs. Maybe. You don't think we've been talking? You're not the only one who wants to help the Solstice Warriors. That's us. And what if you can't do it on your own? Ha! Ha! Uh, okay. Engage primary function. I can just imagine the noises coming out of that trench coat. It's probably going to be a bunch of giggles and farts. I mean, there are ten. Hundred. We can do this. Courage, everyone. Together! Dutch oven trench coat. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, the Dutch oven trench coat. It's real. Okay, here we go. Let's see what abomination they just made. I'm sure it's gonna be horrifying. Help us! <laughs> Kale? Hey, they built another catalyst? She had to go through the catalyst, so she's shocked. Motherfucker. Okay, so I never actually did finish three, like fixing the hydrate redeem. Uploading the YouTube video, which goes live at 1.30 p.m. Pacific, FYI. Took for goddamn ever yesterday. Anyone here? Huh? Hey, a little help, please. Uh, the release button. We should have put it on here, not on the outside. Major oversight. Not too bad, all things considered. Hey, don't do that. Ha, ah, gotcha. I knew it. Fucking giggles. It's trench coat. Trench coat situation. I don't see a release button. Oh, is that the big guy? Punch the part really hard. The release button is your fists. Frog. They made a frog bot with a cannon. That's better. Vision works perfectly. Smell too. Hat. Sorry. Ah, I knew. Fucking farts. They farted. Ah. Called that shit. Mm-hmm. Kale? Uh, yes? So you're Kale. Well, partly. <clears throat> Uh, this could become a problem. We should unite. Your name? Single name. Single speaker. Kale should lead. Yes. Well? Oh, I know. Frogbot. Frogbot. Okay, time for a big introduction. Don't forget to pose at the end. Frog butt. Frog butt. Frog butt. Frog butt. 
Frog, but oh my god, guys, edging me here. For long we have toiled, honing our craft and perfecting our art. Countless wasted days led to a moment where finally, aboard our own creation, we can be free from this time prison. Kevin, it better not be Kevin, Nate the dog. It better not be Kevin. Actually, I wouldn't be too bad at Kevin. It'd be better if it was Kelvin, because then that could be fun. Together as one, we will live on our creations serving the good of the people. And also the kicking of evil butts. I am Retribution. I am the ultimate engineer. I am genius incarnate. I am. All right, the artificer, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Sick pose. Wait, so you're all in there? <laughs> ah, that was so cool. Let Gail do the talking. Long live the artificer. Nice to meet you, artificer. That's a good name. Thanks, everyone. Hey, so we only thought you'd review some blueprints for us. Well, one thing led to another, and the path to freedom appeared, so I mean, we, I, I, I took it. Plus, I must go myself. In any case, the task ahead is way too complex for you lot. I am Dave. No offense, so I won't be a battle unit anytime soon, but I can hack Skybase, all right? Just take me there, and I'll stop the clouds for you. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks, Artie. <laughs> ah, we got a nickname already. This new life is too good. Hey, don't talk. Oh, my bad. Okay, I'll, I'll just do the legs. <laughs> Dibs on camera. Hey, we should offer to go before it gets awkward. Right. It's already too awkward, guys. It's, it's awkward already. We already hit that spot. Sorry about that. Uh, please lead the way. Artificer joins the cargo. Who all do we have in our cargo right now? Is it just Teeks and Artificer? Yep. What? Cool. Cool, 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 cool. All right, so back to Skybase. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Hmm. Okay, well. Well. I see. Uh, how about faking this packet? Good thinking, Spike. And now here. Too easy. This can't be it already. Just try operating a door in Maletto. Oh, there's the other security layer. <sighs> It'll take more than that to stop us. How about this socket? On it. Credentials decrypted. Obvious fakes. Hey, look at that. Oh yeah, blatant weaknesses. Simple marshalling job and... Red. Now to disengage the cloud emitters. Hey, let's make it rain on the Fleshmancer's castle while we're at it. <laughs> That'll ruin his day. It'll take a while for them to fully disperse, but let's make sure the first ray of sun hits just right. And done. Good work, everyone. Dude, this is going to be a tragic story for these guys. Those guys are going to get fucked in a bad way. I bet the Fleshmancer, like, appears at some point in, uh, you know. I'm going to get dismemberinoed. All those little bits and pieces. Yeah, it ain't going to be good. Okay, we got a little whirlpool. That means we can go down underwater, which means we've got a Kraken fight coming up. I can feel my power surging. Nobody look at me. I need to sit down. You did it, Artificer. <laughs> I'm the best. Hey, do the thing. Oh, right. Dude. I mean... 
If I had a sound effect every time I fucking power fisted the air, I'd do it a lot too. Or, you know, power fisting whatever. We finally have a shot. Artie, thank you so much. Hey, don't mention it. Just need soundboard with you all the time. It's true. It was the right thing to do. Plus, it got us out of our prison. Well said, and well done. I feel strong enough to go after the Dweller of Dread now. How about you, Zale? Oh yeah, time for a cleansing. I mean, like, if you're really constipated, you could say, like, it's the Dweller of Dread. And you're ready for a cleansing. It's kind of funny. Okay, anyway. It's Lairs by the moon. We can sail close to it and dive down. Indeed. Okay, so did you guys just abandon the fucking AI core? Where's the AI core? I've got more tinkering to do over here. Be safe. Good luck with the Dweller. Let's go. Serpentine, 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 serpentine. I'm sure there's going to be another save point down below. I think what we're going to do, like, talking like long game here. We're going to do the main quest until we unlock the flag abilities. And then once we do that, we're going to go back to Homeworld and do all the side quests. Slash, there's side quests to do here, too. <laughs> Got it. We need to find, like, save up 800 bucks, too. And we have 80. Eh. Uh, uh. Woo! Look out now. Wait. That way, pal. You may be asking yourself, how can they walk around underneath the water? To which I would say, go back and watch the YouTube video. I'm not going to explain it right now. Oh. Oh. Got him. Yep. Ooh, that's terrifying. This is like <laughs> fucking horrifying to me. Uh, they just, they just, just, yep, you know, we'll just sail off this underwater cliff. No problem. The dweller's here. I can feel it, too. We've got your back. It will be an honor to assist you in a cleansing. Zale? Yeah, it's coming. Oh, here we go. Crack and fight. Oh, shit. Well... Per usual, instant disorient. Fuck yourself, tentacle. Yeah, that's right. Three turns. Lunar shield. Because it's a boss fight, and that's what you do. Ah. Uh, all right. And from there, we do a little sunball test just to see what's up. 1,025 HP. Eight hundred eighty-eight. Okay, so with dweller fights. Okay. With Dweller fights, uh, really it's only the Solstice powers that do any damage to them at all. Like, everybody else is just here for support. Get deflected. So no point in disorienting because, uh, well... 
We don't have anything to show for it. <clears throat> so we'll just get some balls in play. Too bad Squidmaster's not here, right? Strong. Yeah, those hits. Yeah, I'm telling you, like, it's either Solstice Power or nothing, because Solstice Power rocks. So if all the recent uh, knowledge I've acquired about fucking squids is anything at all, we are going to be fighting s three pairs of weak tentacles, one pair of strong tentacles. So it's happening. All right, here we go. Let's do a good old-fashioned Moonerang. Yeah, where are the puns? Boom. Hmm. Maybe we can get 326 out of this hit. He looks bored. So ho hum, life at the bottom of the ocean, eating krill. Let's see, so we can hit everybody with this one. Ooh. Nah, let's get let's get that disorient going. Boom, four turns now. All right, six. Sure. Yeah. Soonerang done. Yeah. All right, so we just broke the lock. That means they don't get to cast their spell, and that is good. Uh, oh, hey, fuck off. Uh, <laughs> yeah, let go. Fuck out of here with that. I don't think so. I find your knowledge of cephalopods to be insignificant. Thank you. I needed to hear that. So goes, look at that. It's disgusting. <laughs> I love it. That is the correct reaction to seeing this thing. All right. Oh, have you guys seen this? This is the uh, Valir's ultimate. Now, sometimes you watch a show and you just go like, I should really meditate more. Boom. All right, let's uh, let's do a little healing light. Let's just save it. Actually, fuck it. Sunball. We're going full offense. That's a strong bitch. Valir is a strong bitch. That should just be her nickname. Uh... That was a miraculous block. What does Warble do? No, we need the other guy. And the puppet releases a soothing mist. Now, right, well, what's next? What are we doing? Can we do another Soonerang? Yep. Here we go. Yeah, bye, Tentacle. See you never. All right, let's get a little, uh, what's Crustad? 
Pride Hero covers 80 HP and 7 MP. We don't have anything that does like whole party just MP. Yeah, it seems kind of like a waste, but here we go. We're going to do it anyway. Need that MP. I don't think this did 500 HP last time, but just in case. Nope. Oh well. Hey, fuck off. Now I bet those things do huge damage if we let them hit. I've blocked that twice in a row by some kind of just miracle, just straight up miracle. Only so we can get balls in play. can combo with a little bit of solstice action and get MP back for both of these two. Sick. All right. <clears throat> Here we go. I'd love to show you guys Zales, but we need the moons. We need the, uh, the lunar hits. Like, I don't know if I can do bonus damage with this, so I just start spamming the X button. Just hit it. Just hit it. Uh... Ooh, really should have broken that. This sucks. Okay then. Okay then. Let's just do. Okay, let's swap. And we'll hook it up. Okay. See, Moonerang, I bet we can actually get 550 out of that if we're lucky. I'm feeling lucky, punk. Mm -hmm. Alright, Disorient. Hit it. Didn't do a lot of damage, but it was worth it for the uh, the MP regen. Fuck. We can disorient again. Fuck yourself. And we'll hit the dash strike.
Shit. Yeah. All right, Zale's ultimate coming up. Ooh, he's nasty. Yeah, this is cool. Make out. You did it. Aha! Valir, we just took down a dweller. No eclipse. This power. I didn't doubt for a moment that we could do it. Same. I feel so much stronger. That thing we did when Garl was hit by the curse, I feel like I could control it now. It's been growing within me too ever since. Keep ready. The moon then? Together. This was the dweller of dread, yeah. Yeah. And was is right, past tense. It's fucking gone now. Unbelievable. Cool, so that's kind of our signal to start doing side quests because we've got to be real close to the end of the game now. <laughs> and they caused a massive tidal wave that took out all of the towns. Look. And the clouds are gone, too. Oh, my skin. Not used to the sun anymore. It burns us. Why did you do this to us? Teamwork. Nothing like it. Sorry, main mission. I got other things to do. Damn right. With their true power unleashed, Valir and Zael can now fly on the world map. Move around with left stick and press X to lift off or land on clear surfaces. <coughs> you can also explore previously inaccessible areas. When you feel ready, the Fleshmancer's castle awaits for the final confrontation. There we go. They literally spelled it out for us, so appreciate it, game. Oh, cool. Ooh, we fast, too. We just left our friends at the bottom of the ocean. Nice. <clears throat> okay, I remember going through here. Let's start here. Oh, a Solstice Shrine. Nice. Look, these are all puzzles. I'm going to change the game title to doing all the side quest shit. I hate that sound so much. <laughs> All right, what's it going to be? What's it going to be? Uh, there we go. The Fated Hour. Spooky rubber chicken.
way. How do we get up there? So we're going to do this one that gets us up in the air, then back over here. puzzle this time around. I wonder if there's like an achievement for touching all the crystals in the game. If so, I think I got this. Uh, hmm. Okay. Can't jump up there. So got this. Okay. Ooh, that's nice. Ooh, that's nice. Uh cool. Oh, that must change where the uh, the little floaty blocks pop up. Mm-hmm. Okay, so what if I move this one down? Schwamp. All right, so now we need to do the two leftmost and uppermost spots. So that goes there, that goes there, that goes there, this right over here, and that right there. And then we make our way back up the little ladder. And fuck. Now we're not. Okay, calm down. Calm down, chat. That's not what I meant. All right, there it is. Shit. Okay, next. Next.
Okay, here. There it is. All right, we got there. Dog, thank you for the gift sub. And Tonkuki Dog 35. What's up? Welcome to the channel. Enjoy your emotes. Do that. Is this a spot? Is this it? So we got to do the other side, I guess. I don't remember what this side looked like, so we're just we're just figuring it out. Uh, what the fuck? Okay. 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 Got it. We need those two. A little hop down here, little hop down there, little walk across, maybe hop up, or two, or three, or four. And you tap the crystal. Three hops down. Trying to go right up the middle? Is that what we're doing? Or I think it's this situation. I think this is what we're trying to do right here. Yep. Got it. On a celestial ray. <laughs> we're about to unlock that big bundle on top. Let's check this out. Celestial ray, what's up? Oh, that's big. Oof. Yep, works for me. All right, next Solstice Warrior Shrine coming up. I like it on the Vespertine. There's always a little something that needs fixing. I like that. It breaks all the time. Bagok! I'll fart fist all over you all day, every day. Ahoy! I was hoping I could trouble you with a little research I've been doing. Of course, what's on your mind, Hortense? 
on your mind, whore? Since, well, you see, we undead folks share some sort of a connection. It ain't telepathy per se, but we can kind of feel what others be feeling. Anyway, there be one among us with a bad case of longing. Fucking whore tense, right? I'm talking really bad. Bloke be carrying enough sadness to drown the ocean itself. Appears you've met him. Used to be some noble of sorts. Oh, Duke Aventry, yeah! I went and got cursed pretty bad, that one. He'd be ready to leave this world, but some necromancer be keeping him on a leash. Or Maya. Bitch. His soul's gotta be bound to some magical object somewhere. Any idea where that object might be? All I know is for sure is to have him to be in a place dear to him, or the tether wouldn't work. That's not much to go on. Well, seems that necromancer ain't that much of the careful type. Crew's been seeing her enter some secret passage. Mayhap she'd be hiding a thing or two of relevance there. If you're interested in helping the poor sod, Yolanda's got some more details. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. We're gonna do the Solstice Warrior Shrines first, but you're damn right. Let's talk to the puppet. Hello, puppet. Huh? Rashawn's puppet points at something on the map. The Flying Isle. Great Alchemist, are you trying to tell us something? Perhaps we should investigate the location. Okay, yeah, 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 got it, dude, got it. Puppet, fuck's sake, man. For not having any words, you sure do talk a lot. Bitch. Bitch. Who's up in the crow's nest? Last time I came up here, there was nobody up here, and that was disappointing as fuck. Finally, somebody. Blear, a word. If I may. Of course, what's up? Ever since the great alchemist granted me this form, I have been eager to prove myself a warrior. For what it's worth, you've definitely been pulling your weight and then some. I appreciate the thought, brave monk, but I desire something more official. Like what? During my time on, our, on your homeworld, I heard a rumor about a place where fighters engage in a friendly competition. None of us have heard of this place yet. This is the first, okay guys? Don't act like y'all been like in the world away from us. According to Yolanda, the townspeople built it to reclaim the big crater left by the Dweller of Strife. Sounds like it could be fun. Valir, I know we are pressed for time, but if there is any chance we could visit the arena in Brisk, I'd be very grateful. No, we got all the time in the world, bro. We're going to do side quests for months. <laughs> Wait, did I put it here? Now, where was it? Lots of old stuff we may or may not need. Valtrade says I can figure it out on my own. This box feels bottomless. What the fuck are you doing, dude? Do you have something for me or not? What's going on? Use your words. I could listen to Keenathan's concertina all day. Saraz's world feels kind of spooky, don't you think? Yolanda's the best boss I've ever had. Work, work. <laughs> She's a peon. That's funny. I really feel like sailing is my true calling now. I don't ever want to go back home. Horton started teaching me the basics of navigation. Just want to learn more. We've got all the supplies we need. Teeks is a really good storyteller. The Sea of Stars was an incredible journey. I'm even happier now with my decision than I was when I first joined. Yeah, dude. You got to see some shit. I think I finally got my sea legs. I'm glad I joined the crew. Squidmaster 2! Dude. You missed a squid boss fight. There was a whole squid boss fight, and we only had 
what, one, one squid pun that went down the whole time? Damn. Damn. Yeah, it was huge. It was huge. What badass said. I feel a bit woozy. I hope I'll get my sea legs soon. Uh, if you don't have your sea legs yet, sir, you're fucked. The Sea of Stars was an incredible journey. Yeah, 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 we got it. Yeah, Nate the Dog did have a good one. Like, I appreciated it too, because it was clearly, I think, a moment where he was probably busy at work and he's like, fuck, man, I got, I got a job to do. <laughs> Oh, you found a new artifact. Yeah. New story unlocked for Estrus Day. I've been thinking about the Solstice Shrines. Might be worth finding the remaining ones. Yeah, me too, buddy. There it is. Yep. Yes. Just taking care of something Yolanda asked. It's good to work. It's good work you all are doing. You have my support. Sweeping is a full-time job. The second I'm done, it's worth starting over. Still sailing, still sweeping. Oh, this is where Garl used to hang out. Just kidding, we're okay. Everybody's okay. Hey, I wanna cook. Oh, there we go. We have all these new recipes that we can't cook because we're poor. <laughs> From a burger to Taki the Champion's omelet. We just need a bunch of eggs and fish and milk and fish and milk and eggs. <laughs> Fuck. I know hindsight is twenty twenty. Almost at the end. Something troubling you? There's another potential threat to my people, one I'm not sure I can handle on my own. What is it? The queen that was. We've been mapping the Cerulean Expanse for a long time, but it feels like we'll never find her. If she gets the jump on Rapine, gruesome thought indeed. Is there any lead we could follow? It's a long shot, but a probe brought this back from one of the search parties. Got Jose's belt buckle. I was hoping we could give it to Teeks and see what we can learn. If we have the time, of course. It's worth a shot, at least. The queen that was. I hope Teeks will have something for us to go on. Indeed. What up, dudes? How do you like our tunes? I like slapping my squid. It's my favorite thing in the world. I put them on a stick and then I slap them around. And then I let them play the flute. But look, and then I put them on the stick, I slap them, and then he plays music. It's a very abusive relationship. All right, I left for a bit and this is happening again. Well, well, If, uh, if it's been slapped, we gotta watch. That's how it is. Slap. Plays a flute. Oh, hey, I think we got some new music sheets. We have 37 tracks. Okay, anyway. Notice how I spit it. Just like that. Bet you we're the only band with a ghost in it. Yep, 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 yep. Okay, nope, we're not gonna do the Wheels Championship just yet. That's gonna be a probably an entire stream. Just going through and playing Wheels the entire time. You gotta kick the can and slap the squid and spin the thing. Spin the 
cello? What's another word for spin that fits with cello? Okay. What's this do? Yeah, so we need to do the two moons, and then we'll do the two suns. Nailed it. Spinello the cello. Dude, that's the, that's the best I've got. Better than what I've got, which was nothing. Just literally fucking nothing. All right, so we've got arrows on a floating. Oh, okay, I get it. So we need to get on here. supposed to get yet. Okay, cool. I think we just need to get to both sides here. So we need to go up for sure. Another up and perhaps uh, yet another up. Rattle, rattle. Yep. We'll go down again. Down again. Left again. Left again. And down again. Okay, this turned out to be like one of the easier puzzles. Hell, I even think I can make it back. Easy, guys. Easy. An eclipse armor. Woo! One more to go. I'm thinking like some new island pops up out of the ground once we get that last shrine. Let's see what this armor's all about. Ooh, that's good. Yep, we get a better benefit from putting it on Zale. Zale, hook it up. Uh, bye bye. Uh, bye bye now. Kind of feel like we should save it. Okay, what's the deal? What's the deal here? Okay, so what's the deal? It's probably gonna pop up out of the ground. We've got three of those pillars to hit. Right on.
That was fucking anticlimactic. <laughs> okay. We'll just leave it there, I suppose. One. Ah. 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 What am I not seeing here? Aha! Touch the crystal. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You just have to kind of like listen for it. There we go. Use your ear holes. Hop, hop. Okay. I wonder if I can grapple onto the bush, the vine. Yep. That's two. Did I just break it? Oh, I broke it. They didn't design that into the game. That's cool. Nice. So we get up here, we get over there. Oh wait, that was it. There it is, there it is. Halaya clearings. Halaya clearings.
Where the fuck is that? Hmm. Okay, well, the next place I'm going to go then is to that mystery island to the very northwest. Because I have a feeling that once we figured that out, we're going to get these crystals here to pop out of the water. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. All right, can we do sun and moon powers while we're flying is the question. Sick. Look at this giant anchor. That's cool. Sunken Dakari ruins. The plot thickens. Speaking of Dakari, we've got to go back to that town and turn in our uh, coral. I mean, our conches. know what that is, but I want it. Come to Baba. Uh, cool. But we can't fart fist. This is where it is. This appears to be a dam. I'll be damned if it isn't a dam. We've got a box, we've got a plate. What does plate do? Can I see? No. Okay, I'm guessing we've got to get box all the way to the left. So we can climb up there. Let's go hit that spinning gear. Raise the water level back up. Hop down, get on top of the box. Is that it? Yeah, baby. Knock that down. Stakes were probably made. Oh, fuck me. That's down really far. Uh, cool. Okay, so huh. So I'm just not heavy enough for that. Oh, that brings that up. Okay. Got it. Yes. That sinks that down lower. Hmm. Okay, okay, okay. Now we're talking. Boom. Boom. And now...
Is that enough? No. Plate. Okay, what's the plan here? What's the plan here? We gotta get this just up one more. That's it. I want that treasure chest too, though. Okay, so that's that. Takari Seal Fragment A. Cool. Um, fuck. I want that. I want that treasure chest. We're gonna get it. Oh, here we go. Wait. No? We go straight down from here. That'll go all the way down. All right, let's do it. We go over, we get blocked. Nice. Send us all the way up. We need to get this wood block over here. Right here. This spot. So to do that, gotta go here perhaps? And then right there. If I go between these two, I'll get over. Right? So what happens if I go there, there, there? Yep. And then right, down, right. Got it. Got it, got it, got it. Woo! I've been fishing in Stardew and trying to figure out this whole... Figure this out with you. <laughs> nice. Dude, I love Stardew fishing. <laughs> it is a really cool minigame. I thought it was really hard at first. I don't know, I just got the timing down eventually. It just took a long time. Like an embarrassingly long amount of time. It's like people get so like, so fucking up in their ass about wherever they have to be, or maybe they just like to drive fast or whatever, and they just expect everyone else on the road to fucking do whatever it is that they want to do. Like they can go take their fucking giant truck, fucking gape out wide and just shove that shit right in their assholes because fuck them. Ba bong mm, somebody's going deeper. All right, another water puzzle. Here we go. Where are we catching this light from? Probably that way? Nailed it. All right, I like the light puzzles. These ones are pretty easy. Hey, Troll Hunter, what up? Didn't get the notification? No worries. Okay, okay. Let's... Shoot that that away. How's your day going? <laughs> nice. You clicked it. Hell yeah. 
fucking fuck those guys. For real. That was the best time to clip, man. You clip when people are pissed. Ranting. Okay. So, how about you do one of those? Nope. All right. And... Making our way up. <laughs> That's cackling Scott. He's like, you good over there? <laughs> Oh, you playing Sea of Stars now? Hell yeah! It's so good. It is so good. Why'd I hop back over here? That's not the way. This is the way. I'm stoked. I'm stoked for you to enjoy this game. It's so good. Aww. Cool. That was way easier than the last puzzle. Let's go do another puzzle. I'm sure that'll make me feel better. Yeah, I never watch movie trailers. Man, I love movie trailers. I love them. It's actually something that I, I legitimately love. Like in high school, I used to love getting super high right before going to a trailer or going to a movie and making sure that I got there early enough to watch trailers. Because this was like, you know, 20 years ago when trailers were, were good and they just made you think. Um, and I would sit there with a notebook and just write down cool ideas in the dark. I'll just write down the cool ideas that I had after watching the trailer because it would be like inspiring, right? Like you sometimes you get so many cool ideas that were presented without giving away the fucking movie and I'd be excited to watch the movie and I was excited about what it made me think about just to start with like as far as like story beats or cool visuals or like, hey, what if we did this? you know, crazy scene that we just saw in this fantasy movie trailer and we applied it to a sci-fi world. Like how cool would that be? Like, that's just where I have, like, a lot of, like, cool thoughts is when I'm watching movie trailers. I still like to do that, but maybe I'm just crotchety and fucking old. But I watch those motherfucking trailers, and instead of having, like, good ideas, I'm just like, fuck you for spoiling the movie for me right there. I don't want to see it anymore. Oh. I was trying... Oh, dude. I was trying to... <laughs> Bad says, I was trying to explain... Outer Wilds to our friend, and I was like, homie, I can't say a lot about it other than you're exploring, trying to uncover things about a past civilization. Yeah, that's about all you can say. There's this, there's a spaceship. <laughs> there you go. The music is bomb. Trail Hunter says, trailers are supposed to sell the vibe of the movie. Yes, trailers these days are just movie recaps. Yeah. Yeah. You wouldn't steal a house ads, high to 2004. Uh, I don't recall those ads. Probably because that was the height of me being stoned. Oh my god, you guys watch Saltburn? I still don't know how I feel about it. No, I didn't watch it because I don't plan on watching it. But uh, Jazzo showed me a uh, a spoiler from it. It was nasty, and now I have no no interest in watching it. None. Right, people sh people should go into Outer Wilds as blind as they can, 100%. Yeah. Uh, ooh, it was the bathtub. It was the bathtub, not the grave. I don't I don't think I saw the grave scene. Like I'll spoil that one for myself. I don't have a problem spoiling like movies and shows that I have that I know I'm just not gonna watch. Like, I'll do it for sure. Okay, where's my end goal? Okay, there's only one receptacle. It's right here. And we can move everything around such that the laser points at that receptacle. And then when we stand on it, that's the generator. Oh, we have two generators. How come you... 
you no longer work. Okay, so these guys only generate lasers when they're on a specific block. <laughs> Just look up You Wouldn't Steal a House on YouTube. All right, all right, all right. Uh, yeah, Saltburn was one of those movies I think you would hate because it felt like everything was just for shock factor. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I do have a gripe. I do have a gripe with that. When things are just like, hey, you're throwing it in there to shock, but there's like no value to the plot. It, it just, it's a waste of time to me. It's just a waste of time. Like sometimes I appreciate it, but unless the plot's moving forward, I tend to be really, really fucking picky. I'll like, I'll give, I'll give a movie a moment, right? I'll give, I'll give a movie a moment just to be like, okay, cool. We got a shock, like a built in, you got me. Like it was shocking or whatever. Like I'm, I don't, I'm not like a fucking film snob or anything like that. Like I like Godzilla versus King Kong, God, you know? You know, there ain't a lot there other than giant monsters, and I'm cool with it. But like, if we're if we're trying to do a, a dramatic movie and you can't fucking move the plot along without doing something stupid, then, then I guess it gives me hope that the barrier to entry for making movies is getting lower and lower and lower. So it's gonna be easier for somebody who actually does know how to write movies to get their scripts published. So yeah. Yeah. I was gagging. <laughs> I haven't seen the bath scene yet, and I got an inkling I won't want to. Yeah, you won't want to see that, dude. You won't want to see it. It's a... Uh, very twisted. I'm still so disgusted. Yeah, dude, like it's rough. Okay, back to what I was doing. All right, we got uh, we got this. All right, so we have a right mirror, a left mirror, or no, right up and down. Okay. So I think we need to release this. This needs to get up into the center spot. So this mirror right here. How are we gonna get you there? How are we gonna get you there? Let's see, I think I can do that there. Fuck. Yeah, that's all right. Okay, this goes here. What was I thinking? Is that right? Yeah. All right, so then that will go that way. So we probably need the left facing mirror to stand right there. I think it's been a month since I watched it. I <laughs> see so you're still scarred by a salt bird. Nate the dog, I'm excited to see the new Joaquin Phoenix movie. Bo is afraid. Uh, Napoleon. Yeah, yeah, Napoleon. I'm interested in seeing Napoleon as well. Bo is afraid. Is that a, the new Joaquin? Is that another Joaquin Phoenix movie? Oh, it is out streaming right now. Sick. I'm probably going to watch that. I'd for sure give that a watch. Uh, okay, no choice. You got to go this way. Um. So left-facing mirror needs to go there. And that means up mirror needs to go there. Hmm.
Hmm. So that goes back there. Fuck. Um. I put that there. That there. That can go up. Wait. I know to watch after stream. Hell yeah. Ah, okay. It's available in streaming my country. Okay. See? That's the argument for, um, which call it VPNs. I heard they're not actually good for security, but they're very good for setting up your IP address so it's like you're from a different country. Uh, wait. This I can move as well. Hello. Oh, there are symbols on the fucking wall, guys. There are symbols on the wall. I need to make those three designs. Ugh. Okay. I think I'm just going to leave and come back again because I was just barking up the wrong tree. Okay, so we need to have, we'll call it the jet, mirror, it's a mirror facing down, jet, and then on the bottom is receptacle. Okay. Well, here's the fucking mirror. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, receptacle goes to the bottom. Let's think about doing that. I've made an official clusterfuck, y'all. This is a cluster fuck. Okay, well, there's that. Check, check, check. Mm-hmm. This is just an extra piece, so I can move this around wherever I want. Same thing with that. Okay, let's get... shit. There we go. Okay, so that gets to the top. Waiting for it to hit Apple TV. I will. I still need to finish Land of Bad. Watch Dune Part 1 and the Netflix ATLA remake. I don't know what ATLA is. Have you not watched Dune Part 1 or Part 2? Yeah, Troll Hunter, exactly. Don't miss out Dune Part 2 on IMAX. You gotta see it, IMAX. I saw it, uh... What is it? Cinemark? They do... It's IMAX equivalent. And I'm trying to think of the name. I fucking forget, but... Anyway, it's sick. Totally good. Totally good. Super worth. Watch it. Okay, 
this is an extra. Okay, that needs to get to the bottom. Mistaking these symbols right now. Might be mistaken the symbols, guys. I'll, oh, Avatar: The Last Airbender. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah Dune two in theaters in, in general was amazing. Yeah, one hundred percent agree. It was great. Maybe wear hair flux. You don't want the. <laughs> it's like yeah, they got a lot of Christopher Christopher Nolan type moments. Yeah, soundtrack hits. Hope Severance is on that list. Severance. Not familiar. I don't even know anything about it. Okay, what the fuck? So we have four symbols. We've got... It's actually the receptacle that needs to go to the far right. Hmm. And then this thing doesn't matter. And that's kind of what I'm thinking. And everything else can just get the hell out of the way. Is that it? Yeah, okay, good, 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 good. Got it. And if I leave and come back, do I get a reset? Do I get to keep my progress? Oh, Adam Scott? Hell yeah. It's seven. Thriller with Adam Scott. No, oh, it's on Apple TV. That's why I haven't seen it. I kept Apple TV long enough to watch Ted Lasso. It's like, okay, that, that's huge. It's like Black Mirror, but better. Black Mirror was sick. And, you know, sick both ways. Okay, so then we've got this one. This one needs to be at the bottom. Mm. 
Hmm. Okay, how are we going to get you to the bottom? Okay, you need to go to the left. Yeah? That's not it. No, oh, dude, I thought that was something that I did in the game. Jesus. Oh, but its ending is just a big cliffhanger. Dude, that's why how I ended up watching From in like two days. Two seasons of From. It was ridiculous. At least there's a cohesive plot for Severance. I don't like how Black Mirror just has different ideas each episode. And that is... It's one, of, it's one of those shows where the writers did just kind of go like, what if, blah, blah, blah. You know, weird futuristic dystopian situation. And then they filmed that as an episode. Which I appreciate on its own, but I do like also having a cohesive narrative that goes through the whole thing. Like, specifically, uh, there are a few episodes that do link together in kind of cool ways in Black Mirror, and I did appreciate those episodes. Alright, what, 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 what are we doing? What are we doing here? Okay, yes, this works. So this is how we get that to the bottom. Alright, now it's, we need the catcher over here. So to do that... Are you going to the office? All right. See you later. Bye. Okay. So you need to get to the left. How, how, how do we do this for you? Okay. Can't see anything there. So if we shoot you straight over there. Yep. I think this needs to get out of the way. Uh, right now on my list is the consultant, the accountant, Masters of the Air, Napoleon Monarch, The Banker, Hijack, The Foundation Series. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I started watching that. That's actually pretty good. Uh, Silo also looks good. Five Days of Memorial. I don't know about that one. What are some of your favorite Black Mirror episodes? Uh, oh, Love, Death, Robots. Yeah, I've watched the first, like, two episodes of Love, Death, Robots. I don't know. It just didn't, it didn't grab me. That's just Apple TV. Not even Amazon, Netflix, or Country Wall. <laughs> ah, nice. Let's see. Do I catch up with Love, Death, and Robots? Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, badass. Enjoy your lurking. But yeah. Concurred. Okay, so now we just need to do... All right, catch her on the left. Left-facing mirror on the right, bottom-facing mirror up top. Okay, and this needs to go at the bottom. facing mirror on the right. Bottom facing mirror up top. So this needs to go up top. This needs to go at the bottom. Mm, right? 
right, right, right. This is extra. Try that. This needs to go on the fucking bottom? Yeah, that works. That's extra. Okay, so set. We got that one. Next. Check, check. Receptacle goes on the left, so we actually had that in the right spot. I heard Defending Jacob and Jason Momoa's C are also good. My dad watched through C and said it was good. I'm more of an HBO guy. Uh, some of my favorite shows are from HBO. Word, word. Hell yeah. Yeah, I've got HBO right now. I do the, like, the kind of, like, swapping... Um, channel subscriptions thing so i'll keep it for like a period of time watch whatever i want to watch and then just like get rid of it until the next show comes out blackbird i suppose is good but it's short as fuck only 57 minutes interesting hbo i just finished i finally finished um the last of us on hbo fantastic so good so so good Okay, we just need the bottom facing mirror up top now. That's the last piece. Hey, you're, this is extra. Okay, try again. it anywhere around here. That <laughs> shit is serious that I was movie. That's funny. I use Apple TV because it syncs with all my streaming services. Okay. I don't think I have a single Apple product anymore. Hydrate. Okay. Literally, the first episode just randomly ends, and you're like, well, shit. <laughs> That's it. Okay. Let's get this thing in position. Let's fucking go. I think this will do it. Pop, pop. Get that out of the way. that back in position. Boom. Got it. Dude, that was the toughest. That was the toughest one of all for me, anyway. Oh, you haven't seen it yet? Okay. Uh, here we go. Takari Seal Fragment C. Let's go get this shit put away. I only watched the first episode because Taron Egerton is hot. All right. Well, color me intrigued.
Oh yeah. That man is chiseled. Eddie the Eagle. Another one I haven't heard of. Okay. Didn't we fight you before? No. No, no, no. We're not doing... You don't get a turn. You don't get a turn. No. That's what I thought. All right, we're going to Lunar Shield. And then we'll start exploring some uh, resistances and such. Sunball. Not resistant, not vulnerable either. Really? Oh, we're going to disorient. This is a couple extra turns. Wait. Who has blade? We have enough for a combo. We don't. Can we do blade anything? All right. How about? Okay. We could do an ebb. That'll work. Wrecked, nerd. Dude, fight music is sick. Soundtrack, they did such a good job. They did such a good job. All right, Arcane Moons. Let's see if he's resistant to Arcane. Nope. Shit, that hits hard. Okay, so he's not vulnerable to... Solar, or Lunar, or Arcane, or Blunt, or Blade. All right, girl. Let's uh, let's do a little Venom flurry and just see if we've got a little Venom vulnerability. Have you tried Salt? Because <laughs> he's a slug. Okay, well, looks like we're just going. We're just gonna do whatever. Ninety minutes of him in a spandex bodysuit. There you go. Uh Okay. That I think we can all agree it was kind of fucked. Oh, I don't have anything that gets all of my characters back up. <sighs> all right, well, here's the deal. Oh man. I can't delay their action. That sucks. All right, let's do a swap just so we get somebody with health in. Let's healing light there. All right, that should that should keep us alive. This guy's an asshole. I didn't realize. Okay, that's cool. You can poop out your little turd guys. Let's see what happens. I need more water, guys. And then we just start spamming X button because I don't know where we're supposed to get their bonus. Uh oh, those guys are still alive. That's not good. Okay, let's power smash and see if we can get AOE damage onto the other guys. I was really hoping that would do the trick.
I don't want those little flea guys to go. I just know it's going to be bad news. Ooh, okay. Yeah, we can Solstice Strike and get a little extra MP going on for these two. That's why I like that ability. That's just like the, the best recharge ability right there for MP. For those two, at least. Moderate, blunt, and arcane damage to a single target. Okay, who else we got? Oh, okay. Okay. That's good. Fuck. Two blunts, a blade, and a poison. We only have four MP. All right. Sick, we have three now? Great. I want to get the Disorients back in place, so we'll do a heal up right there. All right, let's moon orang. Disorient, delay, whatever the hell that ability is, because it's going to suck balls. Fuck. Hmm. Okay, let's get our 15 MP right here. Hey, thank you for the biddies, Nate the Dog. Screw those little guys. Fall damage. You've got a good memory for the... Those are like random bits amounts that I threw in there. And I don't have them written down anywhere, I don't think. I love the Hitchhiker's Guide so much. Okay, Moonerang. Let's go. Hopefully we can knock out that little flea while we're at it. Let's, uh, hmm. The ultimates we're going to hang on to just for a minute. We'll do a disorient just so we can buy some more time to heal up and shit. Hey! What the fuck? All right, let's swap out. I think if we get this homie in, we can do his ultimate and get some heals on. Dude, why? Why did he go? Why did he go? That was bullshit. That's what that was. Dude, that heal is huge. Let's go Sunball. Tried helping with some fall damage to the slug. Rolled a three. Fell out of my chair instead. Rolled one on a deck save. Chair landed on me. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I love it. There's no such thing as over dramatic troll hunter. There's no such thing. Uh, you... Dude, I love that move so much. Balls in play. Ooh. Hate that one. Hmm. Get 
that MP back. And let's just get a party stew. Oh, I hate to do it mid-battle, but I'm going to. I gotta be. <laughs> All right, let's go. You should have a very cheap I'm a poor redeem too. Yeah, I should. You're right. You're right. I should. Uh, okay. What are we doing? What are we doing? What are we doing? Yeah, let's hit up another sunball. That's right. Use that little bit of heal. Ah, I should have swapped somebody in. That's okay. All good, all good, all good. Let's see if we can get uh, combo points up a little bit. This fight's been really good for ultimate generation, but terrible for combo point generation. juice on this moonerang. One thing I didn't realize for the longest time, that you can use the balls for the boost. Or spells, too. Also, hydrate. Oh, yeah, I forgot to fill my water. God, I hate this guy so much. So much. Hmm. Okay. We can disorient. Gives us two turns. All right, so we can get some kind of healing done. Should we do this? Mending light. Oh yeah, this is it. This is the move. Have I tried Yerba Mate? Oh, for sure. Yeah, I like Yerba Mate. I like it a lot. Be like this, dude. All right, we're gonna hit this ultimate. Buy me some time. I'm gonna go get more water. Let's go. <laughs> We've got to be close to winning, right? Well, I'm rich. Goodbye, losers whom I've always hated. Ah, thanks for the biddy. I'm glad that's working. Really? You're gonna you're gonna throw that combination at me? Ya bitch. Let's see. Zero combo points too. Fantastic. Let's just attack that guy. Okay. That's how it's gonna be. Let's see?
Ooh. Not my best. All right, let's... Uh... We're in Lunar Shield, and then we'll Moon Ring next turn. I don't think it's worth I don't think it's worth the attacks to try to fight the fleas. The fleas are just you know they are shitty and that's it. Tis what it is. Let's swap. Let's get this dude in. He can kind of heal himself while fighting at least. Get blocked. Nerd. What do we get? Conch. Most important thing. What the fuck is this? Empty? It's empty. Hey, you in there? What was the point of all this? What a waste of time. Surely the great alchemist had good reasons to lead us here. Getting rid of this threat, perhaps? That wasn't worth it. I love that smoke bomb, by the way. That was good. Really? He just had it on him the whole time? Ha <laughs> ha, always so full of surprises. Let's just go. Oh, I hate it here. Okay, cool. So you're more powerful. Good for you. Like each time that you finish a Solstice Shrine, it shows you this like gate that has a number of lights and a like a little, little like thing on top, a little symbol on top. We've done all of the souls to each time you finish one of the lights disappears. So we've done all the shrines to make lights disappear. Um, so that's done. And I'm just imagining that found it. Luana and Solon, you've come a long way on this journey. Weapons of great power have manifested in the dream world. Prove yourselves worthy and claim them as your own. Yeah, we're going to whip your ass, dude. Get ready for it. And close your eyes. Makes a big loud noise whenever he gets hit in the face. Oh, you're vulnerable, are you? Oh, okay. Well, fuck off. Get that. We'll dash strike. And we'll summon.
I'll take that little bit of healing from the Lunar Shield. Yes, please. Okay, healing light, done. Okay. Really love to have two combo points here. But, you know, not meant to be. Let's see what kind of shitty attack he does. Torblado! This isn't good. This is bad. Alright, let's... Let's focus down the sword. Healing mist, fuck off. Oh my god, you healed your own sword, you son of a bitch. Yeah, the counters are pretty insane. All right. Uh. Mm. That was a mistake. I should have sold to strike with Zale, and then we could do the Moon Ring. Oh, it's too bad. Damn, dude. Let's Sunball here, at least get the sword out of play. Okay. At least I know the pattern for that one. Items. Sick. All right, and we're gonna do the ultimate. That should stop him. And we'll buy ourselves another turn. Torblado to the distant cousin of Sharknado. Exactly, dude. Yeah, we'll get at least three hits out of this. At least. There it is. I don't think we can Goodbye, do losers whom I've always hated. Okay. I think I'll do the lunar shield with the healing and just hope that he only attacks one of us. Healing missed. Miss Sword is feeling better. Good for him. get out of this. Not enough to kill it. 113. We'll take the heal. I'll take the heal over blocking whatever it is he's going to do because we can't finish it. Get. Dude, you got to get a block off. <laughs> Using this to get my attention. Yeah, dude. Yeah, that is helpful, honestly. Let's just go straight up attack. Yeah, 
There we go. Jesus. Okay, we're gonna Lunar Shield. And then Zale can heal up next turn. That's the best I've got. Fucking sword, dude. What a pain in my ass. Really, Torbledo? Okay. Let's see how this does. Would love it if one of their ultimates had some healing. That would be sick. I love this ability. The animation is amazing. Get fucked! You have to have like 21 HP left. Okay. yourself in your heels. Okay, there's a heal. We'll do another heal. Not enough for a combo point. Just one combo point, please. Fuck. We just have to focus at this point. Oh, God. don't have enough for a combo. Like, doing our Solstice Warrior Strike right now would have been just legit, but, you know, we're just burning through them points. He's so fast. I think he's out healing my damage, too. Even with the ultimates. I'm spending too much time healing. It's rough. All right, Holmes.
we could have taken care of that if it had been Valir's turn. Fuck. All right. Every time, dude. least oh we don't have enough for a moon ring of course we don't okay yep let's get our ultimate out Probably should have done Valir's ultimate right there. And that way the next attack. Dude, that almost caught us up. Dude, that counter slash is just fucking stupid. I hate it. Mm-hmm. Well, I'm fucked. Hey, Ode. That was the first time I've died this entire game. It's because I went into that with no food. Continued. Okay, to Mirth, and then we've got to talk to the builder guys so that we can get this homie working at the spa. Yeah, you're the builder. You found any building plans? I did. Interesting. Let's get to work. You can now relax at the spa in Mirth. Who knows what benefits may come from relieving some stress. Cool. I'm guessing there are no more building plans for you. It worked out nicely. Had you already found a profession? Yeah. The place feels complete now. We really have something special here. Thanks again for your help. Okay, so that means no more building plans. That was it. May as well grab all the things. Get in all the harvesting done. Pretend we're playing Stardew Valley. Good thing we don't have a timer going. Glad we got shrooms growing too. That's sick. Hello, spa. What's up, buddy? This place is perfect. Thank you for letting us use the space. Welcome to Spa Le Bes. To treat yourself to a relaxing time enveloped in the stunning nature of mirth while bathing in our mineral hot springs that nurture the skin and relieve stress. Fuck no, dude. Uh, how about a freebie? 250 gold? What does he think I'm made of? Money? Everybody's sad about Garl. Let's stop talking about it, huh? I don't want to feel that anymore. You did it, Luana and Solon. Above all else. <coughs> you have demonstrated the unparalleled teamwork and trust in each other. I am proud of you. Okay. So, the Maya's secret passage. Ooh.
Wait. Okay, what happens if I keep spinning this? Oh, if I remember... Inside of... who? Inside of Ramaya's... Place, we actually had... Pictures that lined up with all this. Okay. Okay. Well, good thing I recorded all my gameplay on the YouTubes. What do you want? Oh, wait, 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 wait. There it is. Mark, green, mark, purple. There it is. Fuck yeah, guys. Fuck yeah. All right. All right. Okay. Pop that over to the side. Hey, cool. Okay, red mark, green mark, purple mark. Check, check, check. That one looks... Just like that. That one looks... Just like that. Okay. Pretty, pretty stoked. That would have taken me a long ass time if we hadn't been recording gameplay. That would have taken so fucking long. All right, here we go. Not seeing anything like it left and right, no secrets. Hey guys. And you burnt. And you busted. Ooh, bones. Found Ramaya's journal. <laughs> she would not be pleased. All right, let's go take it to her. Hey, Ramaya, we found something interesting. Wanted to talk to you about it. Oh, hey, what's up, dude? I don't mind the cold. If only I could remember. Journal? It seems like it belongs to the mistress, but these entries have my handwriting. Ah, yes. I'd forgotten all about the estate. Basking in the summer sun and the flowers, they're beautiful. I wish that I could go there again. I wish... Ferryman will know what to do with that. I bet he will. Okay, let's talk to him one more time. Okay. Kind of sound like a broken record, my dude. Hello, Ferryman. Greetings, adventurers. Seek you passage across these waters. How about the yellow flame? A yellow flame you found, I see. Aboard my raft, I welcome thee. He speaks in verse, not in prose. He's not some basic bitch ferryman. I can't fart around on your raft? Okay. Whatever, dude. First thing you do is check the water. Oh, okay. I've got the name for, for Bist. The nickname, Sierra. Sierra Bist because he becomes a soda. You guys look upgraded. Yeah, you guys are upgraded. Look at you.
We're not even weak. Well, I'm rich. Goodbye, losers whom I've always hated. No <laughs> raft parting allowed here? Well, boo is all I got to say to that. Also, thank you for the biddy. Let's go. Ah, almost. Almost. From the top rope. Ay, ay, ay. Let's get, uh... Homie in play here. Get kicked. And that's how you do it. If you guys want to just, like, give me a cache of eggs and milk, that would be all right. We make the rules now. Fart rafting allowed everywhere. something at least wow okay let me just fuck all those up that'll be awesome God damn, these guys are tough they have a lot of help all right one down at least Oh, the randomness. I forgot. these. Okay, so these ghouls, they just do random attacks. Sometimes they actually hurt their friends. It's pretty great. Those were not the two that I wanted to see gone. That's okay. Let's see if we can get both these guys gone. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Uh, bye bye. 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 Oh, food. I'm dying for food. Maple syrup, guys. Doing pretty good on maple syrup. Oh, look at that tasty, tasty conch. I saw you down there, baby. Yes. The conch god grows stronger this day. Fuels us. Yes. Okay, where are we going next? Probably gonna have a big boss fight with uh, Ramaya coming up here. <laughs> Party stew. Okay, I have plenty of ingredients for those. Not exactly the best for me, but we're just going to deal. Got to save up all those eggs and dairy. Just got to. Excuse me?
Up we go. All right, so this should unlock something over on that side. Yeah, there it is. I'm gonna check this side to see if there's anything. Doesn't look like it. No. We're not going to 100% this game by, you know, not checking out every nook and cranny, so here we are. We'll even check some of them two, three times, seven times, as many as it takes. Oh, hey, guys. I'm guessing you're all stronger versions, too. Cool. Yep. Oh! We gotta put on... We have an accessory that does bonus damage to undead. Okay, so those guys are just straight up resistant to everything but physical damage. Good to know. So, if you like physical damage, here you go. Yeah, that's a lot of damage. That's with a block, too. Woof. We're gonna do physical damage, boom. Get pissed up in here. Douche. Five thousand and sixteen. A lot of XP. Oh, hey. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay. We'll get a heal in. We'll get a heal in. Not on my watch, Sarai. Just kidding. It's all happening on my watch. I love those guys. They're great. Nice. Good regen. A little heal's nice too. I'll take that. I'm just hoping that you guys will accidentally like hurt your friends. Okay, this one might work. Nope. That's that's the skill. That's what I want to see. damage. You're a dick. Okay. 
I didn't like it. That was the move. Six more peaches. I don't need peaches, guys. Ooh. Okay. That's money. I bet Yamara has like a for-profit enterprise happening right now. She charges 800 for her fucking amulet. Hey, we better use some items and heal up. All right, so. Call that good? Yeah. Okay. For Maya, let's hit it. What? You again? How did you find this place? You're keeping Duke Aventry in this world against his will. We're ending this. Oh, oh no, you don't. Don't what? You don't steal my journal and barge in here making demands. The magic object keeps me untethered. Where is it? The locket is mine and mine alone. So it's a locket. The nerf. The coarseness. Not again. Have you met her before? She doesn't seem to like you very much. Enough. There'll be no mercy for you this time, and you will pay with your life. Prepare yourselves. Okay. This is great. Flesh piles and bone piles, baby. Get disoriented again. And then what we'll do is we'll swap out for Zale. We'll get Zale a little attack in. Get some balls in play. Mm-hmm. Great opportunity, just keep getting more balls in play. Okay, no vulnerabilities discovered, that's okay. You live on a bone pillar now. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Uh, awesome. Wait, does this mean I can't reach her? Wow. Okay, so we can't even target her until the bone pillar is taken care of. I'm guessing that's going to be weak versus blunt. Okay. 
Okay, now we're going after it. Now we're going after it. Okay, so... What do we got? Bottle Punch. High damage versus one target. That doesn't do us a lot of good. We got Conflagrate. I'm just seeing if we have anything that will really, really help us out here. Combo wise. Okay, not really. We're just gonna do a single combo point, knock out a bunch of the blunt and blade. First time using that ability. Okay, this is gonna suck. We haven't even seen this. Let's just do it. Fuck it. Altered Bist. He's just a space slug. In a cocoon? He's so mad. Such an angry little guy. Oh my god. Altered Bist like Altered Beast. I get it. Necromancy. Swap for you. Let's get some abeyance going on. Hopefully we can just pull this ghoul into play. Yep. Ghoul's in play. Bone cage. That seems bad. Wow. A lot of health on that bone cage. At least we can attack that a little bit. Something. Do this. See what we can do here. It's weird how the bone pile and the flesh pile make the same noise. The power smashed. Okay.
That's a good heal. Alright, so that's a heal. He's about to get off. Not today. Mm -hmm. Hi, Ball. You guys are really us. Nate the dog, thank what you for the cheer. What number are we thinking of? 69, 69 dudes! Hey! Yeah. Alright, Biss, let's swap you out. Let's get homegirl in here. That sucked. Hmm. Well, I'm afraid we're fucked. Awesome. Ooh, those guys are bad news. Those guys can hit really, really, really hard. Not about it. Blunt arcane and move damage to a single target. Arcane Barrage is multiple arcane hits, single target that also delays its turn. Yeah, let's hit a little advance. We can just get these guys close together. Woof. Woof. We've got to get rid of this little tower before we pull an ultimate out. Here we go. Let's swap for Zale. I think he's going to do more damage. Go, buddy. Let's go. That's something. Lunar ring here. If we could disorient one more time. Oh, we might be able to. Okay, hang on. Arcane Barrage also delays its turn. Hell yeah. That might be my favorite combo move. We got two turns. Let's, uh, what are we gonna do? What are we gonna do? Yeah, give yourself a Hargus too. Why not? Little pulpit. it. I'm pretty stoked on that one, actually. Let's use an extra MP. Okay, let's. You got an ebb? You do got an ebb. Boom. We already have all the balls in play.
Yep, let's delay the turn again. Eat an ultimate. Bitch. Here we go. I love this one. <laughs> Thirteen K, seven hundred sixty XP for next level. Wait, wait, I I yield. Well fought, my lady. Don't you start. It's okay, Ramaya. Just give us the locket, and we'll be on our way. Insolent fools with their powers. They didn't earn bargaining in here, foiling my plans. Here's your locket. Now leave. I tell Duke Gaventry that he's fired. Understood? I made the decision. He's not quitting. He's fired. Oh. My lady, why are you so angry all the time? You know, in my village... Psst, forget it. Excuse me? <laughs> Who do you think you are? Let's just go, okay? Yeah, time to leave. Oh, uh, shit. Funny. <laughs> oh, you clipped that nice. Alright, where, where are we coming up? Oh, okay. Word. Mm-mm-mm. Okay, back to the Duke. There he is. Hey, guy. This locket. Hmm. Ewilda. For you to be the one who saves me in the end. How poetic. Aww. Thank you for your help, brave souls. Please accept this key to my coffin. Its contents belong to an old rival of mine. I believe it will be of value to you. Well, bro, where's your fucking coffin, man? Where the fuck is your coffin, Duke? Huh? Yes. Ooh. The Aventry Quest and... Eclipse Armor. That is sick. The Solstice Warrior's Ultimate... Whatever that said. Oh, you have Eclipse Armor. Hell yeah! Alright, so both of my souls to swears have Eclipse Armor now. You've got nothing. Alright, we're hooked up. Who's he booked? Alright, y'all, I actually think I'm gonna call it for the day. Got a lot done. We pushed the main quest all the way till what looks to be like the final battle coming up here pretty soon. Discovered all the Solstice Warrior areas. So unlocked everything except for the very last one. And that battle with the Elder Mist is pretty brutal. We need, we went into it with no food. It's the only time. That battle is the only time. Let's head back before you die here from Mass Far Deck. Yeah, exactly. Um... What was I saying? Oh, Elder Mist. Okay, cool. So, yeah, Elder Mist battle was a bitch. It was a bitch. <laughs> Let's head back before he died here from a massive heart attack. Oh, that was that was a that was the ferryman's quote. Missed opportunity. Um, so we we're gonna make some food. We're gonna make some food. Go back, do that battle, win it this time because we won't be just like on our heels we'll actually have food to refill mp and keep that sword down because that sword counterattack was horrible yeah that's the big one i think that's the big one that we have left and we need to do the all the wheels boards too best opportunity <laughs> um 
Oh, yeah. Gotta have this sometimes, even though it's colorful and right in my face. YouTube, thanks for being here. Subscribe if you haven't already. Give the video a thumbs up if you like it, thumbs down if you don't. Catch us on uh, the Twitch, twitch.tv slash beardonfire. We'll see you next time.